Hey guys, what's up? My name is Emily Hood and thank you for coming back and joining us here on FHN Today TV on The Hood Report. We have had an awesome winter break and we are ready to get back in the swing of things and we have some awesome stories for you this week. On this week's episode, we will be discussing an update on the government shutdown, this year's Super Bowl matchup, and a look at the new record holder for the most liked picture on Instagram. This year's Super Bowl is set after exciting and controversial ends to the NFC and AFC Championship games. First, the New Orleans Saints played against the Los Angeles Rams for the NFC Championship. The Saints took an early 13-point lead in the first quarter, but in the fourth quarter, both teams were tied up with 20 points. At a third and 10 in the fourth quarter, Drew Brees looked to pass to wide receiver Tommy Lee Lewis when Lewis was hit in the head and knocked over by Rams defensive back Nickel Roby Coleman. Despite what looked like massive pass interference, no flag was thrown as what is being dubbed as one of the worst no calls in NFL history. The Rams then went on to win the NFC Championship game 26-23 in overtime. After the excitement of the NFC Championship game, the AFC Championship game started as the New England Patriots faced off against the Kansas City Chiefs. The Patriots took a strong lead for most of the game, leading 17-7 at the beginning of the fourth quarter. The Chiefs battled back after a pass interference call against the Patriots and a touchdown pass from Mahomes and the two teams battled back and forth for the lead until they ended the fourth quarter tied at 31 points each. Tom Brady and the Patriots won the ball first in overtime and quickly found their way to the end zone to send New England to the Super Bowl. The Rams and the Patriots will face off in Atlanta on February 3rd for Super Bowl 53. As of today, the government has officially been shut down for 32 days, continuing the longest shutdown in American history. The shutdown originally started after President Trump said he would shut down the government if he did not receive $5.7 billion to fund a wall built across the U.S.-Mexico border. This was a key promise made throughout much of his presidential campaign. Last Friday, Democrats proposed a plan that would reopen the government that included $1 billion dedicated to border security. Republicans introduced a different offer, saying that temporary protection for DREAMers under the DACA program would be restored for three years if Trump received his $5.7 billion for the wall. If the shutdown extends to this Friday, 800,000 federal workers who are furloughed or working without pay will have missed their second paycheck of the five-week shutdown. Many who live paycheck to paycheck have been forced to find ways to make ends meet, including visiting food banks to feed their families. With both Democrats and Republicans refusing to budge on this issue, there's a long way to go before the shutdown can be resolved. And finally, to end this crazy week in news, there's a new world record holder for Instagram's most liked picture as the world record egg went viral and gained over 50 million likes. This record blows the previous record holder, Kylie Jenner, out of the water, who previously held the record with 18 likes with a picture of her daughter, Stormy. The man who took the picture, named Sergey Platinov, says the picture wasn't really meant to be anything special. The owners of the account are unknown, but they have posted another picture of the same egg with a crack in it, signaling that more could be coming from this account. And that is all the stories that we have for you today. Thank you so much for tuning into this episode on FHN Today TV. As always, make sure to tune into this channel on Friday to see Dylan Lauer's episode of Hour with Lauer, and I hope you all have a great week.